We're joined by Bobby Madrid, the head football coach at Mark Keppel High School in his third season. Uh, Bobby, you've started uh, practice now. You get the pads on Friday. What can we expect and uh, what, what's, been, what's it been like so far during practice? Uh, practice has been great. We've had a, a good group out here uh, in terms of numbers. Um, we haven't lost any kids. We've gained a couple kids. We're in the, we're in the 50s now, which is I, I think is pretty good for this school. Um, you know, and my expectation for this season, I, I just want us to be competitive. Um, you know, last year was growing pains with us. Um, I always felt last year throughout the course of the season that, you know, when we turn on the lights at Friday 7 o'clock and it comes halftime deep down, I was like, man, these poor kids, you know, we really should be playing JV football, but, you know, we've we got to feel the varsity team. And they did, you know, they, they did the best they could. You know, now that season's over with. They've had a year in the weight room. Um, we're a lot faster. Um, you know, come two, three weeks, you know, we'll, we'll see what happens if, if our if our conditioning and our strength and stuff in the weight room uh, helps out on Friday nights. But I, I just want us to be competitive. You know, the wins and losses, you know, don't don't matter to me. I right now, I just want to give our opponents four quarters of, of Aztec football. You know, give it everything we've got. Um, you know, with that new rule coming in with the running clock, you know, that's. That's, uh, I, I kind of like it, but I, I do not hope that we get there this season. You know, I want us to be competitive, and I think this is a good group. I think they know what to expect now. You know, I, I, they know that, hey, we got to buckle up our chin strap, and we, we got to go hit somebody before we get hit. Yeah. So um, I'm real, real excited, looking forward to the season. There's a lot of, there's a sense of optimism at Alhambra, San Gabriel, even Bell Gardens, where they think that they're all going to compete for the league title, and rightly so, because they all look great on paper. We'll see what that turns out uh, once the season starts. But it sounds like you guys also have your own sense of optimism, even if it's not equated the same as, as what, you know, Alhambra may have or what San Gabriel feels. But you guys feel like you guys are going to, you know, start that path to where you'd be competitive and then sort of build from there. Yeah, exactly. You know, I, 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 one thing I tell these guys all the time, you know, they read these blogs, they read this and that. <laughs> you know, if San Gabriel and Alhambra need all the media attention all they want in the summer, that, that's fine for it. We're happy with our group that we've got. You know, we can stay out of the headlines, and I'd rather sneak up on somebody than, than be a target. And uh, I, the kids accept that challenge. You know, we're going to go after people. We're going we're gonna to give them everything we've got. Um, like I said, we, we threw this summer. I like what we've got. Uh, we're flying the ball on defense, and you know, come Friday, we're, we're going to tell who's ready to play and who's not ready to play because uh, you know we, we put the helmets on this this Friday, so we'll, we'll see what's going on. Woo, Bobby Madrid fired up over here, man. Yeah. Sounds good, Bobby. Thanks for the time, man. Hey, we'll no, uh, we'll see you soon. No problem. Thanks. Thank you, Bobby.